Hello everybody, you are staring at a girl who has vacations on the horizon. I cannot wait. Between working and wedding planning, my summer vacations cannot come soon enough. So with that in mind, I, I ordered some things. I ordered many things. There's actually also still an ASOS order to come, but I think that is going to arrive tomorrow. So you'll probably see that in my next vlog. But I thought I'd just jump right in and get started because we have so much to go through. We have bits from Cezanne, Pepper Mayo, Kukai, Urban Out, fitters house of cb there's so much to go through so we are just gonna make a start i'm going to go through the urban outfitters things first first up we have this adorable cream top it's kind of flowy it's cropped on the back but then it's got these bits that like flow down and it just ties in the middle at the front it's got adjustable straps as well which is stunning i think this is going to be so nice i really want to wear this with like a long skirt i think i think that would be really nice very much into my long skirts for holidays this summer i believe i got it in pink as well yes this will match my road blush very very well wow it looks even pink wrong it doesn't look this pink in real life but it looks very pink in the camera screen but yeah i thought that'd be really cute if i had like a white skirt which i did actually find a white skirt on urban outfitters as well i also got this pink lacy top which i'm not sure on so we're just gonna try and style that up and see how we go but tbc on that one there's actually there's a lot of pink i am just really loving pink at the moment which is so funny because i've always really avoided it but whenever i wear pink everyone compliments me on it so much they're like you need to wear more pink and i've always just been like mm, no but here we are i got this top it is very legally blonde i love it it's got a bow at the front really sweet and then just a low back it's like a halter style i'm hoping this is going to be okay sometimes i need the halter adjusting and like shortening a bit so we'll see how we get on with this but i thought this would look really nice with again the long skirt and then i've got this top which i thought would just be really fun across the board like whether i'm on holiday or not like to be fair these tops i would wear at home as well i got this top so it's like an asymmetric like it's got a little tie i really like the colors but i didn't actually realize how patterned it was because it was a bit ruched on when you put it on but it's actually got like a floral pattern to it which is nice i like it i really like this color i think it'll look nice on me so yeah just like a fitted stretchy top not very heavy at all so great for like summer days oh my god my nose is so itchy i also got this top which for holiday but also for at home this is just a great like night out top like if you just want to wear a nice top for a night out and not really like worry too much about your outfit and just throw some jeans on this is one of those tops that i just think is lovely does the job really well it's a tie halter neck which is great for short gals and then it also has a tie back as well i'm tempted to wear this out tonight i have to go out tonight and i don't really i feel very overstimulated at the moment and picking an outfit is going to be hard for me so i may wear that if it fits well i also picked it up in this mauvey tone which is really nice as well. I really like that. That's so nice. I think that with like a white skirt on holiday or like a cream skirt would be so lovely. Then we have the skirts. We have one skirt. This is giving, it's, this is very boho and very early 2000s, like late 90s, early 2000s. I actually didn't have one of these when these were fashionable the first time around. So it doesn't feel too weird to me, but it's one of those very boho Sienna Miller style skirts. This actually feels nice and thick like i was expecting this to be one very thin see-through sheet of material but actually it's got a really nice amount of material to it i don't feel like it will be too sheer so i'm thinking some of the tops could maybe look nice with that i don't know i'm trying something a bit different for my holiday this year so some of this could not work who knows but i also went a little bit safer and i also got this white linen-y feel skirt that's more of a just straight style and both of these have elasticated waistbands as well so you can wear them higher or lower which i think is really nice so that's what i got from urban outfitters we'll try it all on now and you guys can let me know what you think so first up we have this top which is actually i feel like it's got a hint a tiny hint of pink to it it's a very pinky toned white you can see when it contrasts with this skirt that there's there's just a hint of something but it's still really lovely and then this is the tiered 
very boho style skirt. I think these work really nicely together. I think these tops though will also work with the more slim skirt as well. I'll show you the pink one with the more slim skirt so you can get an idea of like the two different styles but I actually really like this. I think for Greece especially this is such a nice look. This also has a little slit to it which is kind of cute but I think just with a pair of like tan sandals this is lovely. Could I do with a little bit of the length off? Maybe but is it the end of the world? No. If it just sat a little bit higher it would actually be perfect so I might just take some safety pins because I don't need we don't need to have my belly out but equally if I wanted to wear like a wedge or a heel I could wear this a little bit lower on the waist and wear it like this I do have a pair of wedges actually that I could take with me and this could be a nice evening look and would match me up very well to Ryan because <laughs> that's the only way I can compete with his height is if I wear a wedge but I really love this skirt it's so nice this is the pink top I'm not sure how I feel about this don't know if I'm like head over heels in love with it but maybe I need to just try it on with some more things I mean it does work really nicely with the long skirt I don't know if I like it as much as the other tops in the order if I had to rank them even though I haven't tried half of them on I think this one would be falling at a least favorite but it could be nice with a more fitted skirt I'm just not sure I'm not sure I'm a lacy girl I'm gonna try it with some other things that I have in my wardrobe as well and see how we go because it could actually be that I think I'll pack it with me and see see if I wear it but sometimes things surprise you and they can end up being like worn in so many different ways that you never really thought so we'll see but I'm not decided on this one just yet and this is the pink top with the more fitted skirt these give very different vibes I actually think I prefer the floaty skirt which I actually didn't think would be the case however I do think the floaty skirt works well with the lighter version of this top whereas the pink I think it has to be with something fitted otherwise it's just going to be too much but I do think the pink works really nicely with the fitted skirt it's really pretty however one thing I would say Say is the fit of the pink top is actually so different to the very light almost white top there is so much more material around here and it feels a lot thicker as well it feels like they're made slightly differently and like I don't know I felt like it this this feels longer yeah I just feel like I've got so much material around here which I didn't have on the other one but they're the same size so slight sizing discrepancy there but what do we think I actually no I really like this the more that I look at this this is a very fun like dinner out outfit this one I'm not sure on it gives me like weird PVC vibes like the shininess of it I know the vibe that it's going for but this is it's not it I don't know I don't know from afar <laughs> I really like it and then I get up close to myself and I'm like oh no I'm not I'm not sure I'm a fan just I don't know maybe I need a bigger size I'm not sure maybe I needed a size up but then the chest would be it's a bit gapy here so I don't I don't think that's gonna work mm, sad maybe the other halter will be better let's try that this is much better this is much more of what I had in mind I could also wear this a little bit higher as well so it's like really not booby at all really really happy with this I think it's such a nice color this is a gorgeous gorgeous color I'm really happy with this I like the fact that it's not super super fitted like obviously you, you tie it at the back so I could pull it in a little bit more but actually this is so nice not too tight at all yeah okay perfect 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 and I can make it longer if I want as well I could wear it lower if I wanted the skirt and the top to like meet up but I actually think it's nice like having a bit of a break between the two because white to like a dark mauve is quite a contrast having like a little bit of skin in the middle like gradients it a bit better I think and then this is the black top which I've just paired with a black silky skirt which I think just works really nicely I could wear this in the UK away on holiday this is a nice versatile little combo so yeah very happy with this one Next we have bits from a brand called Pepper Mayo who I have just started hearing loads about recently and they actually reached out and asked me if I would like to receive any gifting and I was like oh my god yes they have such cute things so I actually got a set I got these little shorts with this top which I think you've actually already seen me wear in a video before this is the top it like ties in the middle and you can wear it off shoulder or as more of a square neckline it's very very cute i think this top is really nice because you could wear it with other things as well to be honest you could wear the shorts with other stuff too that could be quite fun i also got some bits from them which i have lined up more for my honeymoon my mini moon both to be honest i'll probably just wear the same stuff over again by the time we actually have our honeymoon it will probably be like winter time so really not sure what we're going to do with regard to that but i will not be able to be buying summer stuff at that point unless it's from the aussie brands to be fair but 
I picked up this skirt, which it, it has a like ruched bit to it. It's very long, so basically just full length on me. And it has this matching top, which is so gorgeous. And I think this will work really nicely with jeans as well and things like that. So I could pair this with trousers. This is why I love a cord. You can just really mix and match. So we have this matching top and skirt combo, which I just think is so lovely and elegant and just really nice, as elegant as I go anyway. I like something that's still like a bit detailed and still feels a bit fun, but I wanted something that felt really honeymoon appropriate and I think that fits the bill perfectly for like dinners and things and then I also picked up another set I got this skirt and it has a rose on it you can actually take this off as well I really liked that detail of this it's a ruched style skirt which is amazing for me personally it just works really well on my body type and then it has a matching top with the little corsages as well and these are also removable so if I just wanted to wear it completely plain I could and I really like that element of it because these are obviously like very trend based and it's just nice to be able to have the option to remove them if I want to remove them but yeah that looks really cute as well this next dress is definitely one that I'm going to be wearing on my upcoming vacation I love this so much this is a very me dress so we have it actually splits into two but it's like joined at the side so this is the top half so it sits like asymmetrically it's got this beautiful floral watercolor pattern to it the colors in this are stunning like lilacs blues like a little bit of green and then the skirt which it is attached to is ruched again watercolor floral really really beautiful and the length of this is amazing for me as well and obviously you can wear it longer or shorter and bunch it up more or less depending on your height i'm obsessed obsessed with this so really looking forward to wearing that that's absolutely just like a non-negotiable going in my suitcase that's a going in my hand luggage item like you know I love something when it's going in my hand luggage and not my like checked in bag I also got this dress which is amazing but I need to have it altered so I can't wear it on the current vacation that we're about to go on but it's incredible it's a pink dress just in a really simple strappy style and then it goes down into this amazing flower print and it's got enough length on the bottom that I think we can kind of and be nowhere near losing the flower detailing and it's honestly just amazing so so beautiful so i'm really hoping that that's an easy one to alter that will be a fun one for the vacation after and then we have this dress which could be amazing for vacations later in the year like the closer we get to autumn the more i think i would wear this on vacation it's actually it needs a little bit of altering at the top because it's a tiny bit big for me but it's a strapless style and then it's like fitted along the top half and then it has a very low drop waist into this gorgeous full skirt and it's just the most beautiful chocolate brown color this is incredible i'm gonna have this altered because it is very long on me but this would not only be amazing for evenings on one of my vacations but i also have an autumn wedding coming up that i need a wedding guest dress for so that could actually be an unreal option i have so many options for that one no idea what i'm gonna wear we're gonna tackle that near at the time so those are all of the items from pepper mayo i'm gonna try those on with you now so this is the top and shorts combo from pepper mayo i have to say surprisingly i'm a much bigger fan of the shorts alone with other things than i am with it paired with the top this top is just not not for me off shoulder is just not amazing on me it's cute but there's definitely better out there and in fact the pink lacy top from urban outfitters actually pairs so nicely with these shorts so that could be a combo that i wear instead during the day just a really nice easy outfit this almost makes it a bit too dressy and a bit too like faffy and yeah i'm not the biggest fan of it whereas the shorts are just so cute and so easy they are like they are very short shorts they're they're a bit wild but i do really like them I love this dress so much. Sometimes it's a bit of a weird one to get into. <laughs> it takes some real coordination. And every time I think it's not worth the jail time. But actually, the second you get it on, you're like, this is sensational probably one of my favorite pieces that i own in my wardrobe i absolutely adore this oh, it just makes me so happy it looks so good as well with my little green jimmy choo shoes so good i love it i love it i love it i love it so nice so here is our little cutie corsage dress i love this i just love that you can take everything off as well so if i want to be like no train we can just fully detach this and I can just have a nice little cream mini dress, which I love. I can also take these off. These could be faffy, but like they're, ni they're nice for the vibe. 
loops. It's just great to have the option to remove them if you want, or you can reposition them. I also love that. I could take these two and pin them down here. We could have a whole trio of roses. That would be so nice. I, I just love this. This is a really nice, easy one. Weirdly for me, if I'm feeling bloated, I actually like to wear stuff like this because I find that it's just the ruching. You can really like hide your belly. And I don't know, I just feel like if something's stretchy, I just feel better about myself in it as opposed to wearing something that's like more structured and then your body is literally just like fighting against the garment. I, I just love things like this. They make me so happy. So I love this, but I love this even more. This is such a lovely cord. I'm a big fan of this. It is a little bit long for me, but it's fine. We can just take it up a little bit. I don't plan on it. I'm actually going to save this until my like honeymoon or mini moon or whatever. So I've got time to have this adjusted. I also love the fact that once again, it comes with ruching love 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 you can have as much or as little on show with this as you want i actually also realized that you could roll this under and if you wanted like a crop and skirt you could also do that as well because i think this is lovely like if i'm feeling more bloated this is the perfect cover-up for that and it has this diagonal kind of cut on each side here which i just think is amazing you could also spin this around if you wanted to and wear it low rise and use this bit over your bum if you wanted to really accentuate that there's so many options with this i'm a big big fan of it it's also just a lovely <laughs> stretchy material but it's thick as well like it doesn't feel too thin it's gorgeous and this shoulder detail is just beautiful. It's so stunning. It reminds me of the Reformation two-piece in pink that I have that I just love. So I can see myself re-wearing this over and over and over again. Just gorgeous. And then this top. I could just wear this top in the UK during the summer. Both of them are so great. Even the skirt, I could see myself re-wearing that a lot in the summer with like a plain black top. So just a lovely cohort to have if you're looking to treat yourself for your honeymoon but then want something that you can wear beyond that i think this is perfect this is the brown dress it's so stunning but as you can see very very long on me and as i said earlier it's just so big around my chest i don't really understand <laughs> i don't understand how this happens with sizing but it's got the most gorgeous drop waist it's probably a lot lower on me than it is on most people in all fairness but i actually really love it i think it makes it so interesting and so different to anything else i own so I'm very excited to get this altered i think it's going to be a lovely piece to have in my events wardrobe this is the pink dress this makes me so happy i just think it's so stunning it actually does have a little bit of room around the waist in hindsight maybe i could have gone a size smaller i might just see if we can nip it in a fraction but it's lovely and stretchy and it's just so fun i love this flower detail it's just so stunning and this pink this like bubblegummy pink is just one of my favorite tones of pink ever so cross your fingers for me that we can alter this one and then we have some what will hopefully be stunning dresses from house of cb Ooh, oh my god they've changed the packaging it's like in special packaging that's so pretty gorgeous Wow, that's so nice. It was in a floral sleeve, I love that. They should do that more. So dress number one is this ruched strapless dress. These strapless dresses with all of their ruching look so bad when you just get them out of the packaging and hold them up like they are genuinely scary however often i find you put them on and they just transform and this one i have high hopes for it is this gorgeous like mauvey magenta i don't know what color honestly don't have to describe this color gorgeous gorgeous purple at the top and then it goes into oranges and like gold tones and it's just so beautiful so so beautiful it reminds me of like a barley sunset it's so stunning so yeah very excited to try that on it's got a little thing here as well i kind of wish you had the option to remove that because i could live without it but it's also kind of cute like yeah we'll see how we get on i have high hopes for that though because it is ruched in terms of the length i can just pull it up a little bit and hopefully no one will know and then this next dress i'm even more excited for however i think it's going to need a fair amount of altering on me sadly it arrived literally a couple of days ago i ordered it so long ago but i think they were on pre-order and they just launched them so it's taken ages to come i don't have time to get it altered but this is going to be worth it oh my god it's so pretty so on the top we have this beautiful cool toned pinky color that goes into a lilac that goes into this gorgeous deep purple and then it's very very dark on the bottom oh 
oh my god i cannot wait to try this on i really hope it looks nice i saw it when they launched it and gasped it's just unreal so i'll try both of those on with you now fingers crossed that they look good not a fan of this dress i just had to fully undo all the corseting just to get in it <sighs> that was a workout it's literally just being held together at the back by me i <laughs> it's not worth it it's just not worth it it's nice but no i don't like it now it's not worth it this however this was worth it it's so pretty i love the gradient of it so much it's so pretty i definitely could live without this though this is it's very long i'm not sure if even heels can solve that situation i think on holiday when i'm less flustered from having to fight to get into everything this will be such a nice vibe when my hair is done i'm feeling nice and fresh i think this could be really cute but let me know what you think and then we have a Cezanne order i haven't done one of these in a while and i know you guys love seeing what i pick up from Cezanne. oh my god i love their packaging so much it's just oh, so fun like who doesn't want a cacio e pepe recipe when they order clothes it's very me coded isn't it how high here's a pasta recipe oh my god this dress this is stunning so this is a gorgeous pink linen dress it's got a little bit of ruching to it i'm hoping the length might just be okay on this however you just never know with the french brands and like short girls are not their top priority so you do have to proceed with caution however i think because of the material of this if it was fitted enough i can probably pin it a couple of times and still wear it on my next holiday but if not i will wear it on the holiday after and it will go into my alterations pile you know debbie's gonna be like oh my god She'll probably be watching this just quaking in fear in advance. Oh my god, this shirt is so cute! Can you see that the theme was fun? Are we seeing that? I just thought this with like white shorts, a white top, just so fun. So fun. Gorgeous candy stripes. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my god, I forgot it came with the matching shorts! I might wear that to the airport. Oh my god. And then the final item I got from Suzanne is this just really lovely timeless piece. I actually have a body that's like this but in black and I've ended up wearing it a lot recently. I love wearing it with black shorts or even just with a pair of jeans and I thought you know what we could do with this in a white for the summer but for the cooler days in the summer because it's obviously knitted. Oh wait we have bits of cardboard stuck to it. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah this looks stunning. The quality feels insane. I love that it's got a really wide open neckline so it's just going to be really easy to get on and off that is beautiful with some white shorts with some denim shorts in the summer really really gorgeous and then i can wear it with jeans and things like that as we move into winter so yeah that is it that is what i got from suzanne i was fairly restrained but i'm so excited by all the bits that i got from them so let's try those on now mm, this dress just doesn't give me anything i think this needs to be just a little bit shorter and then i think it would look better but this is not great it's also sitting kind of there's this weird ripple here, but it goes straight across, like, on me, straight across my belly line. So it's making it look like I have a pouch, but I don't, I don't have a pouch. So that's, it kind of needs to be more up like that. That is slightly better. I don't know. I'm going to see if pinning this will help, but it's just not, it's not giving, it's not got a wow factor for me. The hair has gone up because it is too hot today for hair down, but I love this set so so much it's adorable absolutely love i think with a red bikini this would be so nice i'm a big fan yeah adorable 10 out of 10 so so happy i ordered this ignore the outfit change i'm mid trying everything on and i realized there were things i forgot to show you i number one i know i was talking about things that i bought for my honeymoon and i wanted to show you this this will be slightly familiar to you if you watched the south of france vlog that i posted a few weeks back this is actually the cream version of the purple dress that i wore on that trip and i decided that i had to have this for my honeymoon like ryan loves this dress so i was like right we are getting the white version of it or the cream version for honeymoon and i honestly can't wait to wear it i love this dress so much this dress smells like perfume that's so strange it's not been worn so we're all good whoever bought this and returned it you smell amazing wow but yeah i'm really excited to try this on i this needs altering but it's absolutely fine i actually figured out a really clever way to pin the last one so that it didn't actually need like permanently altering and it means that if i ever want to make adjustments to it in the future i can so love that and then i also have the kukai bits they very kindly gifted me these bits and if you had told 13 year old me that she'd be being gifted kukai she would have 
peed her pants. This is quite a magical moment for me because I used to be obsessed with kukai when I was younger. Oh my God, so cute. So we have, oh, I need to take this away with me. We have this blue dress. It's very long. I'm hoping it will be okay. It looks like I could ruche it and make it shorter. So cross your fingers for me that this has a good length. This is so nice, like the quality feels so good. I love this detailing around the chest, so it just sits like that, strapless. This shade of blue as well, beautiful. It's it's giving Cinderella, but in the summer. Yeah, big fan, big fan of this. Can't wait to try it on, oh my God. What a great day. Oh, this is also the top that I was just wearing in the previous clips, in the previous sit down clips unboxing things but in the black because i love it i love it so much and i also got the matching trousers these are elasticated at the waist which we love we love so much they have pockets i'm intrigued to see what the leg length is like i have a hunch that the aussie brands they're going to be long in in the leg just another thing for debbie to take up poor debbie by the way debbie doesn't do any of this for free just fyi guys oh and then we also have it in gray that's going to be so nice for autumn Woo! Oh my god, gorgeous. And then it comes with the matching trousers. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to try this on. These last two are less on the summary train, but I wanted to show you them anyway. But the blue dress, absolutely, if it fits, is being packed with me for Greece because stunning. Anyway, let's go try all of those on now. So this is the Jaded London dress, which looks so scary, but when I alter it, it sits so that my belly is no longer on show and then also what i like to do is i take this slit and i pin it higher so that it sits in line with the ruching it's basically invisible i get a little bit more leg but then also i don't have to take the bottom up which is basically impossible but it just stops this being very very long and i always pin it on the ruching so that the pins are invisible and you can't even see that it's been pinned. You do need to wear nipple covers with this and it is a lot of work, but as you can see with the purple one, it was very, very worth it. This blue dress is gonna be, I think, the perfect length with heels on. Ah, I'm so happy, it's so nice. I'm going to have to resist buying this in every color. The quality is amazing, love the design. It's so flattering, which fitted dresses aren't always. There's just no guarantee, but this is actually so so nice they do this in black as well and i just think that would be such a great wardrobe staple the trousers are about three inches too long on me maybe more but they're so flattering i'm obsessed like obsessed they're so comfy as well and the top is just perfect oh i love it kukai sets are just the best like the quality is insane i love the designs they're like minimalist but for girls like me that don't really do minimalist very well just love it and then we have the knitted Suzanne top it's just a really cute little number what do we think the only thing that annoys me is these bits they're just kind of sticking up which is an interesting design hmm would that drive anyone else mad are they meant to sit like that maybe maybe like that i don't like that though what do we think hello everybody i did not outro this haul i thought i would check in with you from greece our flight has been cancelled so we are here for an extra day, which is very fun. Also a very expensive inconvenience that keeps happening to us, but we move. I have to let you know something. I actually have not vlogged at all. So I hope you enjoyed seeing where all of the outfits are from. You will of course see everything on Instagram and on TikTok. But yeah, the um, the hotel situation, I have not loved it and I didn't really want to like massively promote it. So not so much vlogging going on, but a lot of, a lot of this. A lot of this has been happening. We actually upgraded our room for the last day just to soften the cancelled flight a little bit, you know? 10 out of 10 for that decision though. Very, very happy with this. So nice. But yeah, that is it from me for this video. I really hope you guys have enjoyed seeing everything that I have bought for Crete. There are a couple of items I didn't get to wear yet. A couple of the pink tops I have not had the chance to wear. The skirts. The skirts have been worn to death. Highly, highly recommend the skirts. This is actually quite fun. I get to debrief you on the pieces from the holiday. Oh my god, the, the coloured dress, like the purpley greeny dress. Mm. Chest kiss. It looks I'll put a photo here. I'll pop a photo here. It looked even better than it did in the haul. Once I'd styled all of this stuff up, chef's kiss. I hate when people do chef's kiss now. I'm really cringed out by it, but I have to. It's necessary because that outfit was 
a10. I also have this little, I'll put a photo here, this ASOS Coral, which is one of the pieces that arrived. I actually didn't love that much from my ASOS order, so there was nothing to really show you in the vlog from this holiday anyway. I liked like one or two things. Wait, no, you didn't get to see the green and blue bikini. That was from ASOS. Okay, I will pop a photo or a video of the green and blue bikini. That was from ASOS, that slayed. I will link those in the info box. Those were my two favorite ASOS pieces. The floaty little tops, loved. I actually only got this photo of me wearing the white floaty top last night, but that was so nice. I actually paired it with this more slim skirt and then these little starfish earrings, amazing, amazing. So yeah, that is my roundup. Those were my favorite pieces. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. Oh, the Suzanne, the Suzanne cord. I actually, my favorite way to wear that has been with an orange bikini, which you will see. I've done a video roundup of a lot of my outfits on this trip for a reel. So that will be live soon. So keep an eye out for that because that actually, that is a good roundup of all of the fits from this trip. So that is my little outfit roundup. Those were my faves and the things that I wore the most. I hope you enjoyed this little roundup. I hope it was actually quite helpful. But yeah, that is going to be it for me. I love you so much and I will see you guys again very, very soon. Bye!